Our smoked chicken is now red as you can see. It's uh, golden brown. Hello guys, welcome to our channel. Good morning. Today we are going to prepare cassava leaves. In our language, we call it katapa mixed with pounded groundnuts and we are also going to mix it with umlembwe in particular okra with that we are also going to prepare smoked chicken and we are going to eat it with the shema hope you enjoy before that you're going to fetch firewood I'm going to go to the i Okay, so now we have our sliced tomato, onion, and green pepper. And our katapa also is ready. This is our cassava leaves. And we are also going to add our dry chili. Keep watching. Okay, 
Okay, now since we are mixing it with our cassava leaves, the slices has to be a bit big. You don't have to cut it uh, into small pieces. It has to be a bit big like this because it's going to be mixed with uh, our cassava leaves and also mixed with uh, our pounded groundnut so it the pieces has to be on at least this uh, as big as this okay so now the second thing you put in is okra so we are mixing okra with our pounded cassava leaves after you put in uh, okra then you also put in soda you put in soda Then you stir it up. Then we stir it. Okay, just like that. We had our pounded groundnuts. We had our pounded groundnuts while stirring it up. until they are mixed up together okay so you stir it up now we had one tablespoon of salt, another tablespoon of salt, that's it. So when you're adding salt, you add according to the quantity of what you are cooking. So if it's a lot, you just see like, okay, it's a lot, then you add salt. But you keep on stealing so that eh, it mixes up very well. And uh, since we are cooking on our firewood, you keep stealing so that eh, it mixes up very nicely. Now we had our tomato. So now we get our dry chili. You need to ponder it so that uh, you mix it well with our cassava leaves. Yes, just like this. Okay. So the quantity of the chili you also get, you, you don't have to put a lot. It's just hardening taste. Okay. We are putting our dry chili in our dry chili. it cook for some time so that the groundnut uh, it has to look brownish as you can see it's also turning brownish so you let it cook now I have to test 
chwe mba mie so ina wa language we say okum fwa fofile unfui kabwino mm. it's lovely you need to try this ile unfui kabwino sana it's very nice okay so now you've seen it has turned into golden brown it's a sign that it's now ready cassava leaves now ready so to get uh, a good aroma and a very nice taste at the end of everything you had up sliced onion it gives a very nice aroma you should really try this it's very nice it's nice and unique mm -hmm. so that uh, it tastes and uh, gives a very very good aroma as you can see okay Okay, so this is uh, another way of uh, peeling tomato. If you don't boil it, you don't have a greater hustle. You can do this method of uh, peeling tomato and it's coming out perfectly nice as you can see. As you can see guys, this method of peeling tomato is very effective and it's easy and fast. Like this. It's looking perfect and very nice. Okay, now it's time uh, we do our smoked chicken as simple as this with no spice. It's just simple. It has just have to be simple and natural just like this. Yes. Mm -hmm. Our smoked chicken is now red as you can see. It's uh, golden brown and it's looking it's looking very lovely. You can see. Mm -hmm. It's now ready. This is our gravy for our simple smoked chicken, as you can see. Okay. Just natural with no spice. And it's looking very nice, as you can see. You really need to try this. Now, this is our shema. It's ready now and very soon we will start eating it as you can see. <laughs> Mm. 
Wow guys, this is very nice and it's very delicious. We've really enjoyed this and we've come to the end of the show. Uh, we appreciate everything and we had fun. We enjoyed cooking. I really hope you are following us and if you have anything special you would like us to cook for you just leave in the comment section and if you have anything to say just leave it in the comment section. Really hope to see you next time. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.